Hi guys, my name is Philip and I'm a front-end developer. In today's video, we'll be seeing how to get real-time weather data with curl. So real-time weather data can be incredibly useful in a wide range of industries, ranging from agriculture to transportation and aviation. Simply put, the ability to react to weather changes can not only safeguard assets, but also enhance productivity and ensure safety. Now, let's take a look at how to get real-time weather data with Tomorrow.io. So, the first step is to create an account with Tomorrow.io, which you can do by visiting their homepage, pressing in the sign up button, and creating an account. The process shouldn't take more than a few minutes. Once you're done, you can head out to the API management section where you can find your API key. So this is the dashboard. This is where you need to go, API management, and here is your API key. Once you're done, you can open the documentation and go under real-time weather. So the real-time weather API allows you to access current weather information for a specific location. It's available in over 20 different programming languages. And in this case, we'll be showing how to work with Shell. So Shell is a programming language that's used to communicate with the operating system, but it can also be used for HTTP requests, which we'll show how to do now. So the first step is to check if you have curl installed. You can do that by typing curl version. As you can see, we already have curl installed, meaning that we can run the code out here. We copy it. We put in the API key here. And then we open the terminal. All we have to do is press paste and enter. As you can see, this fetches real-time weather data for the location we requested, which is Toronto. And it provides us with valuable weather information, including cloud base, cloud ceiling, cloud cover, humidity, precipitation probability, and much more. And that would be it. You now know how to fetch real-time weather data with Tomorrow.io in Chrome. Thank you for watching.